The Boise State football team heads to New Mexico this week to face the Lobos on short preparation, and the Broncos will be without one of their better defensive players for the first half of the game. Senior cornerback Jonathan Moxie will stay in the locker room for the first half of the game to serve a suspension for a targeting foul called on him in the second half of Boise State's win over Utah State Saturday night. The flag on Moxie was controversial, and head coach Brian Harson says he made a lot of phone calls this week, but ultimately, Moxie will take the field in the second half. It's still football, all right? Bodies are moving, guys are flying around, and you're trying to tell me that in a split second, you know, these guys have to make decisions. And, you know, the player at Utah State, it's unfortunate. He got dinged on that play. Um, but these two guys are playing. I don't think either one of them, they're not trying to do that intentionally. And, and I just think there's got to be a, an appeals in there where in the heat of the moment, I mean, you're talking about coaching, playing, and making decisions as an official. That's not easy. Harson was also asked about his defense using towels to try to hide defensive signals against the Aggies. The coach said he wasn't a part of that conversation with his other coaches and recalled a time when he was asked to pay attention to the other team's calls. I know people try to steal signals and all that. I don't know which ones do it. I remember as a backup quarterback, that was one of my jobs here. I'd stand on the sideline and Dirk would tell me to watch their signals and I'd be yelling, run, and they'd throw it. <laughs> and he'd look at me and he'd be like, you're done. So it really didn't last that long. So about the first time or the second time it fails, uh, they stopped listening to you. So um, if that's really your game plan, I think you're spending time on the wrong stuff.